Uh, Brent Herzenberg uh, says, who is a surprise cut candidate due to depth position battles, not named Carmen Smith or Hill? I'll say one, Trent Irwin. Yeah, uh, surprise, uh, surprise uh, cut candidate for me. Uh, yeah. But I don't think he gets cut, though. I don't think so. No, I I think he's safe just for, just for the veteran presence. Yeah. Like, it's a young wide receiver room, but, right? But, I mean, if, if it's a surprise, you know, if I got to go with a surprise, one of your prying, your, your twist in my arm. And it, I would say a surprise cut candidate doesn't even have to always be cut. It could be a trade, right? Yeah. You don't know. A team yeah. could come calling for Trent Irwin because Trent Irwin has in spots – Show that he could play play well. Um, you know he he could step up to that to that role uh, if if need be. But I don't I don't I don't really foresee the Bengals uh, moving off of a trainer. One. In that same vein, um, what if a veteran running back like Samaj P. Ryan ends up free on the waiver? So in that sense, I would say maybe Travion Williams could be a surprising yeah. cut yeah. if they say, "Hey, yeah. we like Travion because he can do special team stuff and pass block." Well, some of the, the veteran running backs yeah. that might end up out there that's, on on the roster. Lucky, another interesting thing to watch in the preseason is because he's the kick returner right now. You know, right, I know it's pre, whatever depth chart listed as a starting kick returner for whatever that's worth. But again, that's still that's still an important role, especially with these new kickoffs and whatever too. Right. So you know maybe they the back whoever the backup kick returner is gets a chance and he looks good, he looks good, he looks good, he looks mm-hmm. good in this new style, whatever it is. Right, and now another running back becomes available. Yeah, uh, Trayvon Williams is a. I mean, Trayvon Williams. He would be a surprise. All, I don't think that's a certain thing. Point, yeah, but yeah. I mean, everybody. Some Tanner Hudson has a hive out there for some reason. I. That's I guess another one. I wouldn't be surprised, obviously, but some people are love him for whatever reason it is. But it's a good pass catching tight end. You know, he's he's he's, he's again like we talked about last week. I think people just think he's younger than he is. Yeah. Yeah, it, it not surprised not. me. I, I raised my not. hand as one of those guys who thought like, "Oh, well, he's been on the practice squad for a couple of years, right?" He's like twenty five, right? No, he's he's turning thirty this year. Yep. 